Well, it is a stadium that absolutely oozes history. Here we are at the San Siro in Milan. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Milan, and they take on Dinamo Zagreb. Well, Derek, although the hosts are clear favourites, this could prove to be a tricky game for them unless they score an early goal because their opponents will sit there, remain compact and defend with determination. They also pose a threat on the counter-attack and are really good at set plays. It's going to be an interesting one. Excellent vision. Missing the target by a tiny margin. Well, it's a difficult skill to get right, but he almost pulled it off there. He made such good contact with the ball. Now sending it in. And a struggle to get it away properly. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? favoured a short one here Olivier Giroud at the ready well pretty straightforward for the keeper you've got to say possession one in behind for him to chase Sandro Tonali Diaz Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Ivanushets. And threading it forward. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Now, the pass not finding its target. Well, they might be piling on the pressure, but they've got to make it count in those situations, that's for sure. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. And a goal kick given. Teo Hernandez Sandro Tonari Brahim It's with Giroud Milan moving the ball forward What can they do from here? Won it back And now having a go and that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? Well, they're going for the short one. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross.
Not a short corner here. And still looking for space. What a save! Playing it in. Well, it still could be dangerous. And problem solved for now. Mislav Orsic. And dispossessed. Olivier Giroud. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Rafael Leao. Now that pass easy on the eye. Well, it wasn't a simple save to make. Trying to deliver it accurately. Struggling to get it away. And he takes on the shot. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Can someone get on the end of this? And did his job defensively. Diaz. The clearance wasn't decisive. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, quite frankly, Olivier Giroud hasn't been able to express himself out there on the pitch today, Stuart. Well, he's been very quiet so far. He just hasn't got away from his marker. He needs to find a spark from somewhere and start testing this goalkeeper. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Now oh, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. Well, the referee deciding that it didn't warrant a yellow card being handed out. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. And Milan moving the ball with purpose. Oh, he's given it! Penalty! And an opportunity now for them to jump in front. Well, no card, just a warning and a fair few protestations. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. I think the referee is right here. This to make it 1-0. A goal! Accurate from the spot! Well, as you can see, the keeper just stands still and the ball's hit down the side of him. It's a strange one in the end. And 
and back underway. 1 0 it is. Can they trouble the opposition this time? And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Sandro Tonali. Diaz. Could be threatening. And now they have the ball back. Oh, he's lost possession. It was always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Looking ball. Well, marginally wide. So, so close. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Stefan Ristovsky. Lauritsen. Oh, lovely incisive pass. This could square the game. And still a chance. Well, no damage done. Calabria. Brahim Diaz now. Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Into the final 20 minutes. Difficult to stop him. He has time to play it over. Well, he couldn't worry the keeper with that effort. Of course, stats don't always tell the story. But on this occasion, they certainly do, because they haven't been good enough in the top third of the pitch. And I'm not sure we're going to see anything change here. Brahim. That's a useful cross. Well, to think he only had the keeper to beat. Couldn't take the opportunity. Stefan Ristovsky. On the attack in the closing phase. Luka Ivanushev. Offside, close one. Here it is now, a substitution. Well, Milan are nearly there, and their fans know it. Just listen to the support they're giving their team. Not long left now. Promising sequence. Rafael Leao. It's with Diaz. Kessier. Crossing possibilities. Kessier. And quite simply, wide of the target. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. Prahim. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Really nice ball. It's there for him. 
And that is full time. Really, the worst possible start, you've got to say. Well, it's not the start they wanted. It puts them under a bit of pressure going into the next game. They need to bounce back now. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's put in a really authoritative performance.